everyone, I'm Angela and in this video, let's talk about dead language Latin. Before we get started, let's first take a look at the distinctions between a dead language and an extinct language. The distinctions between dead languages and extinct languages are most common to linguists. A dead language is a language that is no longer the native language of a community, even if it's still used in other contexts. Its uses tend to only exist in specific situations, perhaps amongst individuals or in special circumstances, such as the use of Latin in the Vatican City. In contrast, extinct languages are those that are no longer in current use and that do not have any speakers. While scholars have tried to draw a clear line between the two, the division is still a little fuzzy. Why? Because both languages underwent the same process and no longer have any native speakers. The difference is that dead languages may still have communities that speak the language. History of the Latin language Latin is one of the oldest languages in the world. First scriptures written in the Latin language can be traced back to 75 BC. The Latin language originated and got its name from the region of Latium in the Old Roman Empire. In the old days, Latin was considered the language of scholars and educated people. The Old Latin was different from the modern versions of Latin. The alphabet of Old Latin was written from right to left. However, with time, the writing has changed from left to right script. Classical Latin Classical Latin is highly inflected, meaning that nearly every word is potentially modified based on tense, case, voice, aspect, person, number, gender, and mood. With no central power promoting and standardizing usage of classical Latin, it gradually passed away from everyday usage. Vulgar Latin, essentially a simplified version of the mother tongue, survived for a while but diverged more and more as it folded into various local languages. By the end of the 6th century, people from different sections of the formal empire could no longer understand each other. Latin, now, had died as a living language. Still, Due to the overwhelming prevalence of Latin in early Western literature, medicine, and science, Latin as a language of antiquity never quite went extinct, a term which we have explained just before and has its own particular meaning in linguistics. Today, Latin is still used in many technical fields, medical terminologies, and the scientific classification of species. Latin words are also used in the field of law, you can find unique Latin quotes written on the buildings of colleges and universities. There are very few people in the modern world who can speak and converse fluently in the Latin language. However, due to the fact that many schools teach Latin to their students, there are a few million people who can read or understand the language to some extent. We have already established that the Latin language has influenced many modern languages. The languages that have been derived from Latin are known as Romance languages. These languages are mostly derived from Vulgar Latin. The most prominent Romance languages include French, Spanish, Portuguese and Italian. So that's a really brief overview of dead language Latin. Let me know in the comments below if you would like to know more about Latin or any other languages or more linguistics olympiad questions like comment and subscribe below to support